My name is Shiro Theory and I'm the VP of Engineering at Sendi. Uh, and Sendi is a Pan-African company that enables businesses and individuals to trade. Um, we currently have a market base uh, in East Africa, um, Anglo and Francophone West Africa, um, soon to be in the Northern African market and South Africa as well. So a big problem that engineering leaders, leaders have um, or a common problem or challenge that engineering leaders have is showing the value of the engineering organization to the business and a lot of the times it's because it's very hard to quantify uh, the amount of work we do but also the quality of the work that we're doing um, and so for the longest time the marriage between the engineering teams and the product team has been essential because the output of the engineering organization is normally shown through outcomes and outcomes a lot of the times are driven through the product organization. So Insightly came in at a very foundational time in, um, in the growth of the company because it allowed us to actually track uh, the team's performance, the engineering team's performance through metrics. You know, in God we trust but all others must, must bring data. So this allowed us to actually come back to uh, the executive leadership team and be able to speak in a way that they understand. Uh, so being able to quantify the amount of work we're doing as an organization uh, being able to attach value to uh, the work that we're doing uh, was very foundational to us. The, the challenge we had was figuring out the best tool out there that could solve the specific problems that we had at the time. We considered tracking engineering intelligence metrics ourselves. So these processes, I think industry standard processes that engineering organizations track. So you're looking at, um, say your DORA metrics, so you're tracking your cycle time, you're tracking your change failure rate, you're tracking your mean time to recovery and deployment frequency. So some of these levers are very common across many engineering organizations and people may opt to track them themselves. However, there's engineering intelligence tools that already exist um, that could easily help you track these things um, easily without necessarily having to put in more, you know, a lot of effort. So we had considered it. So um, coming across Insightly was, um, you know, very timely in a sense because, um, you know, we were having a real struggle of being able to quantify um, the work that the engineering organization was doing. Depending on the phase of growth of any organization, the challenges you're facing are different. And so that level of support for us was uh, very instrumental and Insightly came in very handy in that process. I believe that the role of any engineering leader is to add a certain level of predictability and reliability in delivering high quality software. And to do so, you also need to have a happy team and you need to make sure that you have an avenue for continuous improvement. A lot of these facets and a lot of these metrics Insightly has provided most of them out of the box. But of course, there's obviously a layer of, um, of support and work that needs to come from the engineering leaders. Change management is a big problem for any leader. The beauty with working with brilliant engineers is if you can show the value of having the tool, if you can explain the concepts in a way that they understand and in, the, in a way that shows them the value that they will draw from the process eventually, then it's not a very hard sell. Uh, so this for us, again, you know, just with the hand holding and the support that you got from the Insightly team, uh, made it easier for us to also cascade the information or the knowledge downwards to the rest of the team.